the issue of bullying has been there for years and sadly is always likely to be there for years but the more it can be tackled and the more it be, can be given a higher profile the more chance you've got of reducing incidents and putting putting things right. Bullying happened on the bus. It was mainly name calling, uh, physical abuse and uh, throwing my equipment down the stairs. Uh, well eventually my mum phoned up the school and we got through to Mr Middleton and Mrs Maxwell and um, Mrs Maxwell sat me and the bully down and we had a talk and now we're quite good friends. We're on the bus every night, five days a week, and it works really well. I think it was previously an issue, there was incidences on the bus, and I think it was a managerial decision to make sure that the buses were monitored and that incidences could be picked up quite quickly, and it has had a major effect. At break times, as anti-bullying ambassadors, we go around asking people if they feel safe in school, and we use the information we receive to help develop our work. Um, I think it's important that the anti-bullying ambassadors ask us about our opinion of bullying because we're the ones experience bullying or do bullying. When I got bullied, I used to go home and cry myself to sleep every night. When I first started secondary school, I suffered a few problems in my form and I was bullied and it knocked my confidence a lot. Um, it, it makes you feel really small, like you're not, you're not a natural person. I started talking to... sorry. Well, I used to get bullied quite a lot because of my weight and it used to really make me feel upset and I, when I see someone around the school like getting bullied like because of the weight or the way they look it just makes me feel upset because I've been through that and I don't want other people to experience it as well. It's good that this school has anti-bullying ambassadors because you can go and talk to someone, you know, your own age or in your own year group and they might be able to come up with a good solution and you've got someone to talk to. I think it's great that our school has got anti-bullying ambassadors because if someone's getting bullied or you are getting bullied, they're generally nice people to talk to and they'll get it sorted out. The anti-bullying ambassadors are really good because they, like, um, they just... You could just walk around, you could just speak to them wherever, they, they don't mind, you could just stop them and tell them about being bullied. As an anti-bullying ambassador, I've been proud that I've been able to help other people uh, to not be bullied and to help get their confidence back up. Um, I used to get bullied in my old school and because I got bullied I thought that it was, there was nothing wrong with bullying other people. Um, I changed my behaviour by just saying sorry and um, like owning up to it to say that yeah I was a bully but now I've like knuckled down and became a better person. I think that since I've become an anti-bullying ambassador I've become a better person. Um, together the anti-bullying ambassador team they can help tackle bullying at reason. After we came back from the anti-bullying training day that we had uh, we went to our leadership team and put forward some ideas uh, including our Smile and Compliments Day, which was very successful. Well, they came and asked they come to a leadership team meeting, which I thought was a really brave thing in the first place. Um, and they brought a PowerPoint presentation along, which was very professional. Uh, and they talked with a lot of passion about uh, their ideas for anti-bullying in the school. As anti-bullying ambassadors, we run safety sessions so that the kids know what cyberbullying is and how to deal with it. I've learned from the anti-bullying ambassadors today that prank calling is a type of sad bullying and that you need to keep your privacy settings on high else anyone can contact you. Well, the club is quite special um, at break time. We hold sessions uh, where people can come talk to us about their worries or if they're being bullied and we'll just generally help them out um, with the work problems they've got. Um, I think, I think the, the Diana Award scheme has been absolutely brilliant. Had it not been for the scheme I don't think our students would be as motivated as what they are. I think knowing that they're not the only students in, um, in the country that have issues in their school, knowing that they're not the only ones that are out there tackling it, makes them feel like they've got a network of people um, and people to turn to and they can go on the website, they can find out information about you know, what other people are doing and use that in school. I'm really proud of our anti-bullying ambassadors and what they do around school. Um, they work really hard, they put in 110% effort um, whenever they have to deal with anything.